Say that again? Jalaska's following Tau. Okay. 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 Yeah. All right. Well, we're still in mental communication, so that's pretty good. I think maybe (laughs) maybe maybe we should just retire to the office because that should be a safe place, safe for the keys and stuff like that. And you can like work on you can try and check through the accounting. I mean, I can help you check through the accounting. I'm not sure that's my area of expertise. I don't think it's mine either, but I mean, a number is a number. If one number's bigger than, you know, before. Yeah. Lisa has done like a million things in her life already. Like, she's. Uh... Well, I mean, she comes from a big family and she's got a cut. What was a couple of her brothers are merchants and yeah. all the rest of it. So there is I've, a certain amount of, yeah. I've, okay. I've done shopkeeping. Like, I might have some insights, but really. Yes. Yeah, you run more, a shop? I was, I was more on the, like, I was more on the smithing side of the okay. shop than the, uh, okay. the outfacing. But... Uh, and Tal would certainly know all this, too. I mean, she's running her little pie shop. Absolutely. She would know all this, too. So. Mm-hmm. But it's I'm not okay. going to be participating in this. Although maybe later. Maybe okay. that'll be something we'll have to, to hunker yeah. down and work on together. Just FYI, the uh, mind well does not work if we can't see each other. Mm. Oh, oh so. okay. Okay. Yeah. Right. I was wondering, because those abilities are really, really powerful. They kind of have some kind of limitations. There is yeah. a version but, yeah. of it that uh, I think you can... There's a send message or something like that, I think. That's... Yeah, there's things. But my yeah. ability is just, like, basically a cantrip. Right. Um, and technically, it's a round by round. But, yeah, one whittling creature you see within 120 feet. So it is line of sight. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah. Um, so Tao is going up. And are you guys re- retiring to the office? Or are you going back? I, I think so. I, I don't. I'm not. I'm not liking this crowd scene. It seems awkward. Yeah. And, yeah. Okay. I think so. Yeah. In the sun, you're following. Got, or are you got some wait fluid to me. Not too much like fluid. We'll just take it right there. Well, Eric's got the keys. I'll I'll stick yeah. with Eric. Ah. We can't just have him wandering around town on his own. So, Fair enough. All right. Yeah. That seems not a great choice. Okay. Yep. Okay. So, um, so okay. So Tao is going up the stairs. Uh, by this point, uh, Tao is already on the second balcony, going for the third. Um, Chalaska is uh, in 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 pursuit, and of course we have Eric and Lasan both um, rounding the bar um, and and sort of definitely sidestepping and trying to get out of the way of the bartenders as they're doing their thing. Right. Okay. And yeah, moving into the kitchen. Kitchen staff is crazy. That, that place is blowing up right now. Like so many people back, walking back and forth, uh, the servants and everything. Still don't yes. see anything out of the ordinary. Everybody seems to be, well, calm is a relative term in this manner. Things are working They're kitcheningwell. as hard as they can. Yeah, exactly. Things are working well in the kitchen. Um, yeah, and so you, you just kind of like move straight on through there um, to the office. Okay. I have to have, no, wait, we can't go into the office because we have to have Chalaska with us. <laughs> <clears throat> That's what we got. We can't. We can't just go into the office without Chalaska. Why? Because th- that's because of the thing we were talking about last time that the office is like super secure or whatever, and you gotta. There's some we invisible talking, something. Staying at night, fine, but if like I leave, I can't go back in without Chalaska. Right. There, there, there is I don't the. Uh, that. Yeah, 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 that's that's a thing. Um, it's another security measure for for the office and for the keys and such. Um, there is the. Um, the idea, it comes to your mind. Uh, mm-hmm. Eric Chalaska had said that, but is it possible that, you know, maybe Tal also has the same power? You don't know that. Yeah, but I'm not there either. No, that's yeah. true. Yeah. No, I'm thinking when Chalaska moved to go after Tal, we really should, like, remembering this, should have, like, tried to catch her and be like, hey, uh, can you let us back into the office now? It's enough, like, fooling around. we got work to do. Or is that too much? Or is that too retcon now? Too far back? Oh, uh, oh uh, man! No, no. Uh, yeah. mm. All right. If 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 we missed our chance, we missed our chance. It's fine. I, mean, I suppose maybe I should have said you guys roll and have a wisdom check or something like that, and you would have remembered. Um, but I didn't. I didn't yeah. do that. Um, yeah, yeah, we just all forgot. Honestly, I think I think that's just my fault. No, you can retcon it. It's fine. Okay. I mean. With it, but yeah, when when she starts getting up to leave, Eric will try and signal her. Signal her. It's like, hey, we got some got some food into us now. I think it's time for us to go start checking books. Um, so she's getting up to try and follow Tao. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And then uh, she does she does give you a uh, just like a, just a hold on a minute type of thing, and she continues okay. after Tao. Oh. Okay. Interesting. 
So Tao was going back to our rooms? No, because uh, I was going to the vault. Yeah. To the so, vault. Okay. So, right. I mean, then in that case, as I'm... So I'm up there, I'm at the balcony, I'm passing by the guards, they're letting me go. But at this point, I'm aware that Talaska is, like, walking to me. Yeah, yeah, Talaska is not trying to stealth. Yeah, so, I mean, I'll stop up there and just see what she wants then. Okay, okay if we can't get back okay. to the office anyway, why don't we just go with them, Eric? Maybe you can try your keys at the vault and see if they still open things. Make sure they didn't actually get exchanged or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can, get, you can follow or... I mean, if we, if we can't get back to the office, yeah. Split well, let's see what, what yeah. she has to say. We can see what... Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. So she, you come face to face with her, and she's like, um, she asks you, "Is like, where, where are you going?" Well, obviously, I'm going to keep an eye on the vault tonight. Is there something I should know? Because the vault is is clearly secure. I can tell from. I, I suspect that there's a lot that clearly you should know, and that your employer thinks you don't. So that's what we're here for. You got a problem with that? You, you, yeah. Okay. Um, roll an int intimidation check. Yeah, you're goddamn right. <laughs> oh. um, oh, do I have anything that gives me any? I don't think I've got any bonuses to that. I think you might have. Uh, any more? Have it anyway. I didn't roll exceptionally well. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right. So, um, you, you, you do, you do intimidate her, but not, not a lot. And it's just, <laughs> it's to that point to where, um, she's, I can kill you with my brain. Yeah. It, you know, she's, she's going to, she's going to be more aloof on this sort of, she's going to back off basically, uh, mm -hmm. to some degree, give it, getting some sort of like sinister, almost a sinister sort of vibe to you and knowing who you are specifically, this is the greater part of her, um, her wisdom and she is going to just kind of like you know just like make a sound with her teeth like she's clearly clearly not impressed um but she she turns around and uh she starts walking back down the stairs yeah okay okay right. check yourself you don't really have to get up and follow anyway because again while while still in the room, Tao can be communicating this with us. Yeah, yeah, yeah easily. Yeah. Okay, but other than that, I will continue on to the vault if she's going back down. And yeah. Okay, and Lasan yeah. and, and Eric are following. Well, we uh, well, if if she's coming back down, we wanted to go into the office, right? Yeah, if she's coming back down, we'll just have her get the office something that's true. for us. That's that's totally that's totally doable. <clears throat> okay, so Tao is going to check on the vault, everybody, and then we've got Lasan and Eric um, uh, getting an escort. Doing from bookkeeping. Chalaska. <laughs> Chalaska sort of like shoulders past Eric super brusquely. Just like, I mean, their shoulders connect, and she just like just throws her shoulder into it or whatever and just kind of like moves on past and, you know, says, okay. follow me. Yeah. There's a. There's, okay. She's incensed. She's not a, she's not a happy kid. Yeah. Right. Okay. That's right. All right. So yeah, you make your way back to the uh, to the office there. Tao is making the way up to the uh, the vault. I'm trying to figure out who I want to talk about first. Um, we're gonna go for the uh, vault first. Vault first. So, um, Tao, you get up to the vault. the The guard that is there is the same guard mm -hmm. that was there a few um, moments ago when you were up there the last time. Okay. Um, so that hasn't changed. Everything seems to be the same. Um, you can mm -hmm. you can do whatever you want to now. Yeah, and there are some upper balconies. I'm going to go to one of the, the, just one level up, so I get a nice aerial view of the door and keep an eye on things. Okay, so you're going to stay, you're going you're to stay and watch the vault door. Okay. Yeah, oh, that's... that's how I'm spending the night. They're, they're doing like, they're doing accounting plus, you know, resting in the office. I'm going to be watching a door. It's going to be very exciting. Yeah. It sounds amazing. <laughs> we have a great night ahead of us, folks. Ooh, somebody's going to do accounting, and the other one's <laughs> just going to be watching the door. Um, oh, God. Lasan probably be the only person getting some sleep, except you got your brother there, so that's going to probably take your time. Uh, maybe, if you want to talk to your brother. I don't know. You could be pissed off at him for the last time that he didn't tell you where he was going or something. I don't know. He's a bar. He doesn't live on the farm, no. Yeah, the merchant lives on the farm, but he doesn't. 
I believe he spends a lot of time in Waterdeep when he's not traveling from inn to inn. He has a girlfriend there or something? Yeah, half well... Elf? An elf girlfriend, girlfriend in Waterdeep? Yeah, sure. Um, long time. Lives with her in Waterdeep. Yeah, absolutely. You know, long time. Uh, Rabbi Burns. Nine women. <laughs> Fine. It's good. Um, uh, uh, let's think this through then. Okay, so as you guys go back towards... Through, through, the, um, uh, through the bar, through the kitchen again, towards the office... Um, Chalaska is there now, and the door does indeed um, open. Yeah. Um, okay. And now both thank you, both Lasan as well as Eric and can proceed inside if you want. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Now stay out. I, I didn't necessarily say that. No. <laughs> what what's she? Say? What's she looking at you as we go in there? Nothing. She just open. She's just there so you can get through, and you know she's sort of staring off at the. Wait staff and everything in the in the kitchen. Yeah. Okay. She's not even looking. She's, she's not looking door. at you eye to eye. She's just looking. She's away. just standing there guarding okay. the door. Is she gonna like stick around while we're there? Or like, uh... Uh, Lasan, you have the best perception. Uh, give me um, um, give me a perception check. Well, we know how these go. All right. It's a I perception have a check, not a stealth 16. check. It's fine. I have a passive sixteen. Can we just go with that one? Um, you can. It's it, it, it's just okay. Good. <laughs> okay. It was just a little bit higher. Did than you that. see that that one come up and threaten? Yeah. <laughs> and uh, roll it, over. It, it was definitely there threatening. <laughs> oh. um, okay. So you from from your past seeing her before and then now seeing her again, you yeah. notice one thing in particular different about her. Um, it's that her. Uh, normal garb, the, the, the shirt that she wears underneath her, her larger, larger um, not full armor exactly, but it, it's armor-ish kind of, like light layers upon layers of fabric. Um, in, her, in her outfit, there's two buttons, or I guess you can call them buttons, you can call them anyway, it's some sort of like little metally bits um, okay. that normally she has uh, pinned and they're missing. You do notice this. That's why you needed a higher than sixteen. You needed you needed uh, you needed to mm. succeed a much much higher check on that. So you got she's got two things, middly bits missing that you can. Tell. Okay, okay. So we we're noticing this and noticing that she was upset the way she hit Eric and stuff coming by that she like we we're really stepping all over this lady's toes. We've oh, yeah. come in and we're yeah i kind of get where she's coming from so can we let, let's just try to to chat with her to talk with her say you know thanks a lot for helping us out with this uh boy this place is busy tonight oh my goodness i, I mean our you know does it get rowdy like like you know have you been in a fight here that just try to find a way to smooth the waters a little bit hmm. but also to kind of find out what happened with it has she been in a fight we didn't see that. We haven't seen anything go no. like that going on in the bar, but let's, you know, see if we can find out what's going on with her then. Okay. If that's the thing and noticeable, is it been, does, to me, does it look like it's been ripped off? Is the, the like if you pull a, if you pull a button off, you might get like a piece of the material that's been torn, um, snipped off. Is there a thread hanging there? Um, like, what are we seeing? You know, you, then? you needed you needed an eighteen to uh, just to spot uh, the difference, and oh, you did get okay. a nineteen. You got one oh, above. I I will say that um, it doesn't look like there's been any um, altercation for it. It doesn't look like there's. It doesn't look like it was. It was forcibly. So there's removed. not a hole of of material ripped out with it. No. Um. There is there still thread from the button or whatever had sewn this on. Yeah. Yeah. But do it, we it remember looks... what this thing looked like exactly? Yeah. Um, it, it, you know, Next just one. for the sake of, um, just so you can kind of get a get a visual. Actually, I don't even know if you know, know what the um, Zinterim insignia even looks like, but it's that. It, it's a couple of those, um, just to so rank or, or station basically. Okay. Um, yeah. But it was like a metal something that was sewn onto the material, like yeah. to her. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so missing. yeah, again, trying to smooth the water. You know, thanks a lot for helping us out here. Boy, this place is bit. Wait, I didn't realize this place got so busy on a. Tuesday night or whatever the hell it is we're here for, um, you know, like, and you're still on duty, you know, long hour, just chatting her up, just talking a little bit to her, and then, you know, kind of mentioning that, like, my goodness, and it looks like you've been doing double duty tonight, like, what happened there, kind of thing. Uh, give me, uh, what would it be, diplomacy check, I guess, to see if no you can clue. even... Seems 
reasonable. Yeah, give me a diplomacy check because she she might not. Which be one is for diplomacy? Coffee. I don't. Um, uh, it's you need we don't have that. I don't know if you have a um, if you have a proficiency in it. If you don't, you don't get the bonuses. But... I don't see um, diplomacy okay, is on the uh, list anymore, guys. Persuade, it's persuasion. Right. Persuasion, persuasion is, oh, persuasion is diplomacy. Ah, okay. Sorry, I had the wrong okay. word. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, Please. Oh. Crap. Yeah, she's gonna she's gonna kind of blow you off. In fact, you keep talking to her, and she, you can tell that she's hearing your words, but she's not even looking at you. She's just looking across the. She's being really passive aggressive. Yeah, well, it's possible that well, that masculine not... insignia is for the door or something like that. As Chad's pointing out, so that could be a setup to something. And okay, if what? it wasn't stolen from her, then who did she give it to? Okay, well, if being nice isn't working, then we're just going to ask her right out, what happened what? to your insignia? Yeah. yeah. Uh, Try to be nice. Wait, wait. While, while we're doing this, I'm just, I pulled out and I'm sort of counting the keys, both to show her that I still have them, that I haven't, like, effed up and lost them. Right. But also, like, kind of count them to make sure nothing weird happened. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so... Um... Right, so the first let's see, first things first. Um, you say, uh, Lasan asks you, says, you know, I don't know ask if you're right getting um, abrupt with her or not, but yeah, when you say you, uh, what happened to your insignia, she's just like, she looks at you really fast and she's just, and then she, she looks exceptionally yeah. worried for a second and she just says, stay here. And then she walks out the, uh, oh, walks out the kitchen. Uh, can we get like an insight or something to see if like we think her reaction is genuine? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, Lasan and uh, Eric, both you, you have the ability to get an uh, insight. Um, is oh, is oh. that is not that was threatened to be on a seventeen, and then it went to a three. Um, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna. <sighs> when it comes to, I, I, what I'll say is, Lasan, you're just kind of taken aback that she said anything to you after. You, Apparently, <laughs> you're just like, whoa, what? She actually responded. And um, Eric is, you're pretty sure she was genuinely surprised. Yeah, that, that seemed to worry her. Hmm. No Should we, we be following her? I don't know. Like, where is she going and why? Whoever listens, you know? <laughs> yeah, it, we have authority here. Yeah, if, you do. If, if, we, if we follow her, then we can't go back into the office. No, we, we just follow we her, her and get her to but, put us back in. Yeah, I, I, I think seeing where, seeing what's up with her is probably important now. We could split up the party even more. Have Eric yeah, stay no, in the no, office. Yeah, I, I, there I think, you go. I think, I think the two of us should be sticking together. Whatever. We'll all be back here at midnight. What could possibly go wrong? I think, no, I I think th we should both go. Yeah, I think we should both go after her. Not, ne not necessarily try and drag her back to the office, but we want to find out what's going on. Maybe yeah. we can get more of the idea that we're on her, that we're on her side. Mm. That, now she's worried about that thing, and you pointed that out. So maybe ah. that'll. But yeah, no, we should we should definitely go after her. Yeah. Does that look yeah. like it freaked her out? We need to know why. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. let's go. Okay. Follow her. We're not we're not like sneaking around. We're not like stealthily no. trying. We're just no, 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 we're no, going no. somewhere. We're, not, we're following. We're let's go. Follow she she starts going through the kitchen. I guess we could catch up and like, Eric's gonna try and. Uh, I don't know, and I don't know how Eric's gonna try and like catch up to her and like not physically touch her because I think that's probably not the right move in this situation. Maybe not. But <laughs> it's like, hey, hold on, hold on a moment. Just let's 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 figure out what's going on here, quick. Is 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 that thing? I'm not gonna say insignia right in the middle of the kitchen. Was it? Is that thing tied to your ability to, you know? How big, um, how big a security concern is this? Um, um, she says specifically that, uh, well, actually, does she say anything again? She, you know what? She's just going to walk out. She's just, she's not just even listening follow, to you. Just follow her. Okay. <sighs> mm. <laughs> she, she's got something very specific in mind. Just follow her. I'm, I'm torn between, because... I don't, I don't want to play it wrong and like piss her off, but it also seems like may, like the thing to do, kind of like the Eric thing to do, might be kind of to actually just like grab her shoulder and sort of force her to discuss it. I, I don't know. I don't want to though. <laughs> I just letting her letting her storm out and not talking to us isn't great either. But uh, I don't know. 
I, I don't. I don't think I'm going to do that. You know, probably should. <laughs> we'll, we'll just follow her. I think. It is follow her. <laughs> okay. All right. So this this is what you guys are going to end up um, doing. All right. All right. Yeah. So you're going to follow. Um. Yeah. So she, you not trying to hide the fact that you're following. You're, you're heading back out. She does know that you're following. Um, and she turns around at the uh, entrance of the kitchen, um, to the bar, that whole area there. She turns around. She says, "Stay here." She re reinforces what she said earlier. And well, I, I think at this point we can say, "Well, we have orders from." The yeah. Yeah. the guy's yeah. name, who's the leader, who's almost like her name, Nalaska, N N whoever he is. Yeah, it's it's Nalaska, but yeah. Nalaska. Hey. Okay, we've got orders from. So, uh, we we have our Nalaska. own orders here, yeah. yeah. Um, Nalaska, right. we're trying to make sure everything is good, everything is secure here. Ah. You need to know how big an, how big an issue this is. We don't want to make a big deal in crowd. Just let us know what you're thinking. We can try and help. Right. Um. She um, she says, if you want to help, stop making things complicated. And um, <sighs> she turns around and, uh, uh, well, she's, she's looking past and she looks past you or whatever. And she looks down the, uh, the end of the kitchen there and she says, and would you please either go into the office or shut the door? Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. We didn't shut the door? <laughs> I... Of course, we have the key. Oh, crap. This is. You're you're an evil, evil. She doesn't need her insignia to open a door. That's interesting. It's not related to that. Nope. No. No. So it is probably more of a like people thing. Mm. I mean, I could open the door, and I don't believe I've got anything in my inventory that would be equivalent to yeah. the insignia. I'm trying to figure out. Right, this is adorable. For that Gilbert now. is down here. He's <laughs> sleeping on the chair next to me, and he's having some sort of dream. So he keeps making little sounds. Oh. I keep <laughs> looking over. I'm like, "What the hell's going on?" I finally figured out. It's Gilbert having a dream. Oh, it's adorable. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna rule for this um, now. I know she's completely stressed out, but generally, I mean, people aren't that dumb. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do it. Oh, let's see what we get. Dumb for she, what? No, no, <laughs> she rolls exceptionally well. Okay, um, this is this is good enough. She turns around. She says, "Stay here" or whatever, and she turns around again to to leave. And then she stops. She's, she's mid-stride. She stops. And she... And she comes back to where you are. And she says, turn out your pockets. Everything. Oh, shit. Oh! She's looking exactly... Like, right in your eyes, Eric. She's looking right into your eyes. That's what the ghost was doing. He wasn't taking things out of your pockets. Oh, he was putting something in. What have I got in my pockets? I'm I'm going to say that. I'm like, oh. is, that, is that what that magic thing was trying to do? Oh, uh, sure, there was a magic thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> no, it... <laughs> Interesting. Um, yeah, she does oh. hear that. She does. She, she takes that into account. She's not going to like discount everything because she's she's a smart yeah, individual. Okay. But. Yeah, she's, she's right. not I'm going, I'm going. I'm going to reach right for where the keys are and empty that pocket first. Sure. See if that's where the insignia is. Yep. Okay. Is it, so the key, the keys there, or where the keys were anyway? I think I've got them wrapped. I think I've got oh, them probably yes. in my hand at this point. But like, the reach in there and is the insignia in that pocket? In the in the pocket where the keys were? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. You've got yeah. two buttons on you. Little ones. Two. Okay. Oh so my goodness! Out, so someone like, some was of, some of that little. So Eric, it wasn't someone trying to steal the keys. It was someone putting that in your pocket, and hopefully she's smart enough to realize that we wouldn't have brought this up if we had stolen the well. The, the she's not. She's not I, too... I'm trying. I'm definitely trying to play it that way. It's like yeah. She's so not even looking at you, the You brought it up, but then again, it's not too... who is Eric? She doesn't know Eric. She knows Eric came with you. But then again, she doesn't know if you know if Eric is a uh, is yeah. an accomplice to something, you know. Oh. Anyway, so accomplice. I I pull I pull those out and it's like, someone is trying to turn us against each other. I realize it's not too hard. I ha I hand her back <laughs> things. She seems to um, you know, strangely enough, even though even after this whole thing and being really aggravated with with um, not just you guys, it's not. So much the hatred being tossed in your direction. You're just the only thing for her to focus well, on. Well, we're messing um, all yeah. over her territory. Exactly. We get that. There's yeah. a lot of that going on. We get that. 
Um, but what she does um, do immediately, she snatches the keys from you. She takes the keys away from you um, immediately. Keys are on the chain. That's fine. Tied to his waist. Tied okay. to your waist. Okay. When she okay, then she tells you to give her the keys. There, there's some slack. She can take the keys and hold them while we're talking, <laughs> but That's she's true. not really going anywhere unless she's, we're going to have some kind of chain removal. Big fight here. Yeah. yeah. She's got the keys actually in her hand. Then she's asking you to to remove uh, the chain from your um, unbind the chain from your body. Um, and then she um, All right, things, you start to see people moving around the corner me. of the bar. It's exciting there. Yeah, you start seeing people, like other soldiers, moving around the corner of the bar um, and looking, peering in or whatever. And she uh, motions to them and she says, go, go, find, go find the widow. And, whatever. and, then she yeah. just, and, they, and they, they, they disappear and they start running up the stairs and stuff like that. Um, right, so there's a bit of a, a problem, though. You guys are standing right in the doorway and the servants are still trying to, they're, 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 they're like, um, they're holding stuff, <laughs> right? Okay, let, let's, let's take this back into the office. Shall we? Let's take this back in the other. Yeah, you know exactly. we were appointed by your boss. We can work together on this or, or we're going to have a problem. Let's take this yeah. into the office, shall we? No. So um, what happens, actually, she's not going back to the office. <laughs> she's not going back to the office. She's she's um, actually sort of, while you're still trying to unbind the key, she's kind of pulling you forward into the bar area. You don't know exactly where she's trying to take you at the moment. You can resist if you want to, obviously. Back into the crowd. That's smart. Because Back she's into the a crowd great, because... intelligent leader. This is good. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Or maybe sorry, she doesn't want to be alone cause... with you. That could be another thing. <sighs> yeah, that, that's understandable. So, sorry, what's she, what's she trying to do with the keys? They're... Yeah, she's just got them hold, waiting on she's you to uh, release them, relinquish them. Yeah. Oh, keys. It's a sticky situation. What do you do? Well, Let's agree that keys stay in office for now, okay? Mm -hmm. Bring someone in. We don't have to be alone in there. But let's go back into office and sort this out. You can leave the door open. Someone. But, yeah. Someone Do we really trying... want to bring this out into the middle of a crowded bar? Someone is trying to mess with all of us. Uh, give me a persuasion check. <clears throat> Actually, both of you. You're there both kind of like barraging her with these these. I options. have a pass of 60. <laughs> no, that's can perception. I want persuasion. Oh, persuasion. Yeah. Mm, that's not as good. Please. Oh! Damn it. Wow. Oh, the 23. You okay, I just saw you know, five and thought I assumed it was mine. <laughs> this, is, this is actually quite good. Um, This is what I'm going to say. Specifically, you brought it up first that she didn't have her insignia. So yeah. It automatically gives her a little bit of trust in you. Yeah. And now you're yeah. saying you what we need to do is not bring this out into public areas. Um. She's listening intently to you right now. You you are certainly on her side. She feels. Okay. You, you just you just sort of work through. Trying, you wiggled right your way right start. into her good books. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. The problem is is she still doesn't like the idea of going. Um, although you know what you're, you made her way as a, as an ally of hers. So Eric's no longer as big a threat. She knows that the soldiers are going to come towards to find her so if she does move towards the yeah. office everything should be fine you know what okay so yeah you guys can move back towards the office we go in the office leave the door open you know your guards are coming we just this this is a moment to sit and talk through some things not get a little crazy mm -hmm. yeah. deep breath time <gasps> yeah. you know oh my okay. god so at some point, some guards are coming to find me. Yes, uh, Tao, you yeah. um, you were staring intently. I'm guessing uh, at the um, at the vault doors, making sure nothing weird is happening. Um, but you do notice something weird is happening as uh, several soldiers, and they're tapping the so shoulders of other soldiers um, along the way, and then more are sort of like flanking in, and then instead of having two as guard, they're leaving one behind as three as guard. And moving up, and then the extra soldiers they're they're gathering, and basically they're just making sure that there's more guards on duty, and grabbing the ones that don't need to watch the stairs. A massive pile of soldiers are coming your way. Yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So it could be a little right. Bit... So there's going to be fewer people guarding the balcony that are protecting the guest rooms, but more people guarding the door of the vault. Exactly. Okay. Okay. So right. So yeah. You see them coming. Um, they say, uh, you're one of the first, the guy that I guess is the leader. He's going to be another guy. He's going to have a little insignia too. You don't know if it worth, it's worth anything, but he's got one. 
He's, he's, mm-hmm. he's the leader of all the other ones. <clears throat> anyway, he says to you, he says, uh, your, your presence is requested. Chalaska has requested you downstairs. You come with us now. No. I must remind no. you that you are here <laughs> under the authority of Nalaskar. We are here as well under the authority of Nalaskar. If we have any reason to have to bring you forcefully, we will have to employ those measures. The first person who touches me dies. And I just, like, sort of rest myself on the balcony and keep looking at the door. Ooh. They can do an insight check to find out that I'm 100% being serious right now. Ooh. All right. Um... You know what? So roll it. Although I'll actually probably just do non-lethal to right. knock them out. But all right. So um, yeah. So uh, it is. It is worth noting that there's. Um, that you are facing fourteen people at the moment. Okay, that's that is a lot. That is a lot. I will agree, but just so you know. All right. So mm-hmm. yes. Um. He he he. Uh. He's he's quite sure that you're very serious, and um. Yeah. He's he's like I. Well, I guess we have no other choice then. Uh, roll initiative. Well, I'll be using the cloak of air right now, so any attacks against me do have disadvantage. Okay. So I'm gonna put uh. most of these guys. I'm gonna put them all on the same because there's no reason to go back and forth for anybody else because it's just you versus 14 people. <laughs> no. Would, would would they actually do that, or would somebody go back and talk to Chalaska? They they also know yeah. that we've been hired. Are they going to immediately just attack her? I mean, they know we've been hired. They know we have authority. We've been in the vault. We've been in the office. They're... Are they going to do this? Or are they going to hesitate for a minute and go get Chalaska? I, I mean... Well, they're, they're in, their instructions from Chalaska are to come and get Tao. Tao is not is refusing to come along. So yeah, they have I mean, really no other ta- choice but then to try to do it forcefully. Which, you know, I don't know. Okay. This is... uh. Okay. This is this is intense. This is this is super intense, right? So there's there's mm-hmm. no. Um, we have Quill with an initiative of 16. These guys are gonna have an initiative of well 15. So they go right behind you. Um, mm-hmm. I'm I've got 14. Of them. I just got a standard sheet over here. I, I I this is it is dangerous, but I don't I don't know if it's undoable. I you are the widow, um, so there is something to that. Mm-hmm. So so presumably the guy who was talking is like the sergeant or whatever. Yeah, he's like the and, third in command or something. Yeah. Right, and he w- so he was reaching out. I need to put a token on here, um, so I can. That doesn't matter actually. I can just say you go and then I go. We don't need a turn order for that. Yeah, okay. that's, that's uh, fine. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, we don't need that. So let's go like that. But yeah, so presumably he was he was the one he was going to reach out to like yes. grab my arm or something. Right. Um. But no. Um. The thing is, is that they all draw their weapons. Um. You've got a few crossbows trained on you as well. <laughs> um, and yeah, so he draws a sword and he takes a, a swing. Um, but you know, you're, you get to go first. So whatever you want to do. Yeah. And he is the one closest to you. So I suppose if you're going to act, you act upon him if you want to. They're attacking me. Yeah. That's, that cannot be allowed, especially like the widow is going to have, has to have a reputation mm-hmm. within the Zentrim that I cannot let go. So this, this guy, this, this sergeant who's taken that first swing at me. Mm-hmm. He's absolutely going to get a full powered sonic blast. Like I'm almost like not moving for the first one. Oh, okay. I'm just going to like you know sometimes I flavor text the attacks as being a dagger thing or whatever, but I am just going to melt his brain. I will say that I'm I'm going to be trying to knock him out instead of killing him, yep. which you can choose to do in fifth dead. Yep, that's so, fine. Yeah, that's yeah. that's more than uh, what but they're like, going to give give you. I mean, they're... yeah, yeah. There's no uh, riot suppression he here. Just this is just drops. straight on gonna <laughs> Yeah, hurt I'll just like give him a seizure. It'll give that the other in and you know, give the others hopefully a moment to th- remember the fact that you've been given authority by their boss too. Yeah. Yeah. Higher yeah. than Chalaska. So you there, so look at that. I, lovely. I twenty five damage to his brain. <sighs> Alright, that that is that is plenty. Um that that's uh Wow. All right. So yeah, he I'm starts... hoping he just like drops, like twitching on the ground. You know, blood coming out of his nose. Yeah, he, he falls straight down um, and is completely unconscious. He is, he is yes. out of it, completely out of the fight. <clears throat> now, um, uh, go ahead. So then, I, I, and after that, I just say, I just turn it to the others at this point. So I haven't like made eye contact. I've just been like 
haven't even been sort of looking at them directly until now. I've been looking at the door, but then when he drops, I'll turn to the others and say, I am watching this door. And then I'll just look away again. Oh, you're not even looking at them. All right, you know what? That's that's worth uh, intimidation, especially after that. You get a bonus four to your, your, your roll. Oh, shit. You want me to do an intimidation roll? Yes. Okay. Roll high. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's a 22. You did. You, you, you Actually, you I guess 26 with the, the plus four. That is insane. You succeeded. Um, Because, yeah. Yeah. Right, because they rolled exceptionally high. They didn't roll a 20, but they rolled a 19. And that was, that was, you rolled wow. a 19. That's excellent. All right. That's good enough. Um, They, they sort of falter in their, in their positioning. They don't walk away, but they don't attack either. In fact, um, one being, of them... Being clear, though, you didn't kill that guy, right? Because in 5th Ed, usually when you drop some... Well, I don't know when you drop someone in melee, you can lose, but yeah. Assuming. Yeah, no, I was I was going... So he's he's going to be unconscious. Okay. Yeah. But still, like, he's stable. Yeah. So I think it's like the 1d4 hours he wakes up again. Yeah, so immediate, instead of immediately attacking back after you drop their, their, their captain, if you will, um, one guy uh, gets down on bended knee or whatever and starts checking the vitals of, his, uh, of, the, of the guy. And uh, realizes he just says really fast, he's like, "Oh my God, he's still alive!" And he grabs him and he just like you know, throws him on his shoulder and starts to uh, head down the stairs. He's like, he calls out really loudly, "Medic!" And by this time, music has stopped. Music okay. is done. Um, and there are are more soldiers coming in through the front doors, and there's also more coming in um, from the lower levels from the back side of the complex. There's more and more soldiers coming in. And um, they are doing, they're making preparations to remove people from the uh, from the tavern. Okay, so all of this was visible to all the people down in the bar? Um, the people down in the, no, well, the, they didn't really notice too much. The music stopped because they was forced to stop by other soldiers. And now the people notice that the other soldiers are telling them to leave. So the party is done. They're shutting down everything. Yep. Yeah, they're closing yeah. it up tight. Yep. Now, closing it up tight because of this altercation, has somebody been sent to warn more soldiers? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That was from the initial thing. I don't really, I don't really talk about it because just in case things got really, really crazy, obviously, as yeah, you know, I okay. need to make sure that you don't really know how many soldiers you're going to have to okay. end up fighting. <laughs> okay. So, but you know, there's a lot of them. That's okay. True. All right. And none of these, none of these guys have thought to go back to Chalaska and say anything. Well, no, no. The, uh, the the captain is being taken downstairs right now. Um, yeah. There's there's you know they're doubling their efforts. More soldiers are coming up the stairs and everything. There's going to probably be an issue with uh, Tal still at this point. Although the intimidation check was was immense enough for 14 people, they'll probably end up talking down um, the rest of them from fighting, maybe. Um, but right now, kind of at a standstill. And the people. Are I leaving. mean, I'm not making any more aggressive moves towards them. In a sense, like. I'm, I am actually trying to de-escalate the situation, in a sense, <laughs> but through yeah. intimidation rather than, right. you know... Okay, so we're at a situation yeah, where words. Eric and I and Chalaska are at, in the office, which is across the bar, through the kitchen, and out the other side. So we don't have any idea what's going on. No. The guards, out of all of these dozens of people, there's not a single one of them who's willing to go back to Chalaska and have the idea that maybe we should tell her something. And Tao's not moving. So we're done today? <laughs> This is um, <laughs> this is intense. Oops. <laughs> so we we've gone into the office. Chalaska is like demanding that I relinquish the keys, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah. So is I'll she... I will I'm I'm not looking to start shit. So I I will what, as long as we're in the office, I will start like removing the 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 chain well, from that, around my belt. Is that still what she's doing? We were in the kitchen just walking back, having the discussion at this when we were last here. Is she still doing that? Mm -hmm. Is she? Yeah, yeah. She, yeah. Still, she still wants the keys. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. Especially because Eric's carrying them. Yeah. She doesn't trust <laughs> Eric at all. See, she trusts no, see, you the okay, thing but is, she does not trust Eric. Like, Chalaska might be completely innocent and all that. And that, that's definitely your first impression, is that we've it's noticed something. She freaked yeah. out. We know this shadow thing happened. He's got... On the other hand, it could have been Chalaska that did that shadow thing and set this whole thing up to frame us that's to true. get for her i mean she could not it looks like she's innocent There's, in all of this that, yeah. that 
not necessarily so either. No, you you are right. That is definitely a possibility. I think I'm going with Occam's razor right now, which is that <laughs> the, the framing was not done by one of the people involved. But we'll see. We'll keep, yeah. we'll keep an open mind for that one because that. Yes, that keep an open it. mind for that one. Well, yeah. sure. But, yeah. So in in the office, though, I'll remove I'll remove the chain from around my waist mm -hmm. and untie it and stuff like that and take it out. Uh, but I'm still like holding the chain there. It's like keys. Until we sort this out, keys stay in office, right? Yes, absolutely. Okay. But you won't be in the office. We'll see what Nalaskar says when he comes back. We still need to sort this out. I did not take your things. I, I figured out when you mentioned what happened. Mm -hmm. She pointed them out because we didn't know what was going on. So we need to figure out who is screwing with us? Now, someone yeah. used some kind of some kind of power that worked in your room and did not trigger alarm. There was a, it was like a it was like a shadow or something, shadowy dwarf-sized figure, but that could mean nothing. It reached into my pocket. I thought it was going for keys. I checked; keys were still there. Did not notice that somehow your thingies got into pocket. And you, you when we. Out, Sorry. When we first mentioned this, you were heading somewhere. You had someone in mind or someplace to check who has been near you, who has had the ability or, or the opportunity. Or who has been trying to get your rank insignia. And who do we know is dwarf shaped and sized? Yeah, well, these are all <laughs> things to consider. Um, but at the time that she's trying to consider it, um, and listening to you, she is. I mean, obviously, she's going to be a detective in this <laughs> thing, too, unless, of course, she is yeah. a helper. Who knows? Um, but she... Um, she she hears over her shoulder says Tao is not moving, sir. What do we do? Um, and the sergeant's so, forgotten his father. He doesn't remember how to write his name. Yeah. So. Oh yeah, that's the other thing. Yeah. Sounds guess, like uh, Tao is did. still watching the vault for Nalaskar. Yes. We haven't communicated, but I'm just like I'm guessing because that's what she said she was going to do. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I have um, no idea what's going on up there. And the other report that she does get is that um, the captain was attacked by Tao, but is still alive currently. So um, hey. the only thing that, that... I never said it, put a hand on him. Never laid a hand on him. That's true. He was... <laughs> no, they don't know that he was attacked oh, they in know. any way. Oh, they he know. They know. Out. They're not well, stupid. Know, but you can't say he pulled a sword, he didn't shoot a gun, he didn't do anything. He just... No, no. The guy fell down. Yeah, you, you don't, guy you don't have down. to. They, they're, they're quite... Um, they're quite... They know about magic. They know it exists if they don't even cast it. But, um, right. So, anyway. Um, right. So, what are you going to do? Okay. Um, she says, uh, give me... Uh, Give me six men to guard these two, and I'm going up there. Why don't we go two? We got to work this out. We have a problem here. There's Lock too up much your going office. on. Everything is so complicated. I cannot allow people to keep walking around with, like, without any. What is it? This is the term. So you're gonna leave for. us here with, in the office with the keys, okay? Yes, because you can't. I'll start working on books. Well, that works. Oh, whatever. She, she just wants you guys. She, you're fine. She doesn't care about you. She's mainly just watching uh, oh, oh. Um, Eric. Sure. And she even tells you, says, watch your friend. And she, she walks <laughs> off as six more guys come in. Uh, or Buzz. Six more guys come to uh, come to your side there to keep, to keep watch on you and kind of usher you into the office. And they shut the door yeah. and they stand guard outside. Oh, good Lord. So we're locked in the office. Unless, of course, you want to fight that. Yeah, I, like I don't think it's actually locked from the inside. I think no. technically we could unlock it. Well, but yes, yes we, are, we, are, we are being held in the office. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, then okay. you don't even have the keys. Yeah, so that's the thing too. Yeah, at the, at the moment, so the door is shut. And so uh, I, I thought he said like the keys are staying in the office. Hold on. When, when is he taking the keys out of the office? She has the keys in her hand now, and she's she's leaving with the keys. No, no. I was. Oh, I was no, 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 no. There, no. She was, I, I was very clear. We're not. The keys are not leaving the office until we sort this out. Yes. If she wants, if she wants to leave, if she wants to hold us in the office, that's fine. But the keys are staying in the office. Yeah. And that, that was what I thought was weird. Like we, yeah. there is she, a situation. She was, she was holding here. them, but I was still like holding the chain until we like put them on the wall. Right. Yeah. You guys make this so difficult. Um... <laughs> We're making it difficult. No, no, no. No, I, I mean, and, and, okay, we've been talking to her. We've we've reached a certain rapport here. Mm -hmm. 
there is a situation. Tao is trying to guard the vault. Mm -hmm. You've got the keys. If if there there's a lot of suspicion, there's a lot of things. Wouldn't we be better off sticking together in all of this? You have enough guards to not be afraid of us at this point. No, no, <laughs> you know, right now she's, she's Tao, terrified you know? of, of Tao. Well, she, yeah, okay. We know this, except for Tao. But but let's we need to work this out. You know that we were hired by your boss. We're kind of on the same side here, or we should be. And keys and are, trying to keys are in the office. Everything is safe. Everything is secure, as far we as we hope. know. We don't actually know that. For all we know, there is someone else who has the ability to get in here. So her keeping the keys is, I'm absolutely fine with that. I just think we need to go with she can't, them. She can't leave Eric with the keys inside the office. She doesn't trust then, Eric, and there's just... Then you keep the keys, but we're going, we need to go with you. No. <laughs> She's not gonna do it. Uh, you could try to persuade again, but roll like, for initiative. You you yeah. are uh, you guys yeah. are, are currently at this point where it's it's more words. You're not physically doing anything, but it's getting to the point where it's starting to be like you know nobody's listening to her, and she does have access to the guards. She will apply force if she has to. And right now, she feels like she's going to have to anyway. With talent, but then that she's got to realize that this is just making her look like a guilty party. We are supposed to be on the same side. Do you, I, I mean, you're, is this yeah. really what you want to do? We need to work together here. We need to work together here. I rolled a 21. Yeah, you rolled, you rolled really well again. Um, all right, you know what she'll say? She says, okay, then you can come with. He still stays. <laughs> oh, I did that much. I did that much. There is a, um, a, 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 a prison in this complex um but she can't quite get there yet and so eric has to stay in some form of restraint um while she goes and figures out how to even remove him so there's that so so the, so the proposal is that you and the keys go with chalaska i guess i stay, in, I stay in the office yep guarded by soldiers eric that, that might have to be it eric. might have to be if, if it's okay with you, it's okay with me. I have nothing to hide. Okay. okay. All right. So Lasan and uh, and Chalaska are heading. But don't let out. don't let Chalaska go anywhere without you or Widow. With the, as long as she has I keys. I will try. Yeah, she hears I you say that. I don't have the ability to melt brains, yeah. but okay. Yeah, she, <laughs> she, she does. She does hear you say that. But at the very same time, uh, you know, you, you guys are now leaving. The door shuts. Um, guards are outside. All right, so now Chalaska and Lasan and some more guards are heading up towards the top. The, the, the guards down on the main floor are doing an exceptional job of removing people as fast as possible. Um, the band members are no longer there. They were one of the first ones to get out. Um, and <coughs> At least your brother should be fine, whatever happens. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, so he doesn't know what the hell. In fact, he's probably very concerned about what's going on. Um, so Chalaska and Lasan. Lasan, you do notice that... Um, while you guys are heading upstairs, there's more and more soldiers, and there, there's some even pouring into um, the room where you guys are staying. So apparently, uh, Alexei, if he's uh, currently having a nap, is going to be woken up here pretty soon. Um, okay. Yeah. So anyway, um, and then Chalaska's heading up to the to the third balcony, trying to get up to the uh, where where Tao is, and Holler's in in preparation to Tao. It says, "Stand down. You are outnumbered." And Tao's going. I have, there's. She's got no weapon in her hand. She's just standing there. <laughs> oh, good I have no Lord. reason to believe uh, that you might be at fault, um, specifically, except for your acquaintance, or possibly an accomplice in in an attempt to rob the Zentarum. But your boss is robbing himself. That doesn't make any sense. I don't follow. Well, we were hired by your boss. You know this. I do know this. So what, why would your boss rob himself? I don't know. It would, it's not his money, specifically. You know what? It's fine. If anything happens to the vault uh, while I'm away, then we know who to blame. I can totally shoulder that blame. There is that. There All right. is that. Oh, my goodness. So we got her to accept responsibility, and th th that's fine. The widow's not going to start a mass fight. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, the whole thing is she was trying to avoid that. Yeah. It meant giving, you know, someone, you know, a stroke. 
Well, <laughs> so be it. Possible. So, uh, so again, he's going to be drooling soup out of the one side again, of his mouth for the rest of his life. Chalaska, we're here to guard the vault. We're here to make sure things are. I, stay guard with us. Keep the guards here with us. I mean, well, I mean, at least this some is. Some of you are. I can, this I is can what tell. we're here for. This is what we were hired for. And again, if you're worried about something, shouldn't we be keeping this together? But she says specifically, she doesn't know exactly why you were hired. Well, you're finding out now. But you know we have authority. We know we have the same authority here as you. You know this. Yep. You were there when it happened. I mean, what are we going to do to here tonight? We're guarding. We're either guarding this 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 uh, vault tonight, or what? Like, what are the options here? What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting that we have a uh, a bit of a, a trial for your friend downstairs. Who? A trial, and you? Oh, you mean Eric? <laughs> Eric was found in possession of the ability to move around a little too freely here, and I was already upset about the fact that I was not the only one anymore. You have some ability, I'm oh, supposing, to cast really. upon you to, to move around as I do. And Eric has been found with my uh, insignia. Which was brought to your attention by us. By you? Yeah. I can't trust Eric. Okay, so wait I... a minute. Am I, am I basically hearing here that you want to put Eric on trial because you're pissed off your boss hired us? No, I am this willing is kind to put of the Eric bottom on line trial here, because <laughs> he needs to stand trial, and I am starting to believe you're a bit naive in your friends and accomplices. I think there's someone in this room who's a bit naive. Yeah. yeah well, that's that's Clearly you've lost control of the situation, and I can see why your boss... Clearly Hi. doesn't trust you, and most likely you're going to be removed from your position as soon as we're done our investigation. Be that as it may, I am not removed yet, and so therefore I have uh, the command of these soldiers, and these soldiers will obey me. Anyone who does, if you push the situation, is not going to come to a good end. But we don't need to fight now. There's like there's a, there's an audible yeah, murmur yeah. of like relief when you said that, in amongst all the soldiers. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just how like... many people actually have to die before this becomes reasonable I mean this is yeah. it, you have no authority to put him on trial We were he was hired by your boss you have no authority to try him, Th that is just ridiculous that makes no sense it's just, I have it's all ridiculous. the authority, he is not here when he is gone I have all of the authority and what were your orders about us when he left to keep an eye on you is that why? Okay, now wait, then I'm remembering things wrong. Like out of out of no, we're character here. We're keeping an eye on you. <laughs> well, that's just it. That's that's I mean, the whole he, point. Did the he whole not tension in front side of, of this her? Is that nobody trusts not... anybody? <sighs> yeah. yeah, I know. Yeah, you guys don't trust her. She no, definitely doesn't trust just you. Fuck all these guys. <laughs> Let's just, just 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 leave. That you I like tell psych like psychically at this point. I'm like, you know what? This is stupid. <laughs> If they want to get themselves robbed, I don't give a shit anymore. Yeah, yeah. This is why I broke up with the Zents once before. Ooh. Well, there's that. There Too that. many factions you fighting against one another. No? No, this oh, is no, all no, 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 he's just telling it. me. All right, that's fine. It's all um, it. Well, I, you know what? It, it, this was your job. We were here to help you. Mm. Yeah, If that's what you're going, I could care less. I have the Zent army, nothing to me. Well, one of the first things we need to know, and you can say it out loud so every one of my soldiers can hear it, is what exactly is your purpose here? I think I deserve an answer, and if I'm going to come to any, any agreement. Well, I mean, I mean she must like know. She knows, times now. She knows, but she knows because she, you, yeah, you, have, you haven't specified this to stop the, like, the money from being lost. No, because she just said, oh, the boss could be robbing himself. I mean, this is getting, yeah. no, no, that's we're what, going that's in circles at this point. Tao, does, Tao said that. She didn't say that. Okay, but she knows we're here because we're guarding the vault because there's been... There, there's a difference between thing. guarding the vault and investigating the disappearing money, though, yeah, I think. There's a huge yeah. difference. I, I know that that seems like the same thing to us, but I don't think that's as clear to her right yeah. now. Okay. So it's I'd very tricky. The whole wording and everything, and the lack thereof, um, and she's starting to realize, in fact, after after even... Uh, was it Tao or was it the sign that said it? I think it was Tao who said it. Specifically, that her station is at risk. Um, 
is, you know, it is, that, she was, that was in her this way. head from the beginning. She says that right now, you know, that, that was in her head from the beginning because without an Alaska telling her exactly why you guys are here, that makes her fear that her station is, I mean, that's, she's being com completely honest right now with that. Yeah, she has no reason to hide that. And in fact, she's even doing that to maybe figure out more about what you guys are doing and whether or not you can vouch fully for Eric or is Eric just in on this on some other in angle. on what if she doesn't know what we're here for what is eric supposed to be in on for a heist? this is not making any sense that's to what me. she's thinking now i mean why would the keys and why would the um the keys being taken or he is in charge of the keys at the very same time he also has the insignia in his pocket so he can easily easily you know as soon as you know guards are turned one way or the other or if he even has the ability to put them out you know, kill them, rob the vault, and then throw them in there for all she knows. I mean, it's it's totally doable in her head. So, so and so, yeah. we're and and but we've been saying all along, stay here and guard with us. Keep your guards on hand. We're on the same side. We're not trying to sneak around behind her back. This woman is starting to right. sound like an no, idiot. No, no, no. Of course, <laughs> you guys are not. But who was Eric? Eric could have been playing you for weeks now. Yeah, but she, uh, for what? If I okay, what I'm not understanding is Chalaska has no idea what we're here for, and we are saying let's keep all of us together. Where is the danger to her? If she doesn't know that, I don't know this. I'm sorry, this I'm just not. My brain's not following the logic here. It sounds like she she's just reacting on fear. She exactly. she's just completely reacting on yeah, fear. Yeah. But it's, it's, it's totally rational And, and to her against the orders of her boss. No, no, she's under her orders. The boss is, is now gone, and she is to maintain, you know, her station here. And that's what she's doing. Okay. That's, that's normal. Uh, there's nothing outside of the realm that she... She hasn't done anything outside of the ordinary. I don't know, but you know when we were arguing with her in the, in the kitchen area, my whole focus the entire time was, like, the, if the keys... If we're not with the keys, the keys are in the office. How is my insisting the keys go in the office, yes. like, lend towards nefariousness? And how is our insistence She doesn't know how you got her together. insignia to begin with. That's the other thing. She's getting cranky because we're stopping her from stealing money. Wow. Yeah, that's what be. it's starting to sound like. More all the time. Could be. You know what? I'm going I'm, I'm to accuse her of it. You're I, getting... I've been thinking yeah. she was innocent, but I, I'm not so sure anymore. <laughs> I don't know. Clearly, at this point, you're uh, mm -hmm. interfering with our ability to investigate what appears to be a conspiracy to steal from the Zentarim, and therefore that makes you the primary suspect. This is ridiculous. How dare you cast an accusation my way? This is the least ridiculous thing that has happened all evening. Yeah. Right. Yeah. At this point, I think that's good. We're, we're, we keep saying we need to stick together, we need to work together, you would have us in your sight. We've insisted the keys be locked up. We're guarding the vault with guards in plain sight. You're the one putting a block on every step of the way here. It's starting to look not so great. And the guards are hearing this, too. We yeah. are here by the authority of your boss. We were given authority to do that. You know this. Yeah. It's very important that within all the soldiers and stuff that we do make a bit of an effort at this point. If, yeah. if we're going to start sort of casting... You know, these accusations, yeah, we no. need to work to delegitimize her yep. in front of as many guards as possible. Yes. Yep. Cats There's got to be some mind. doubt somewhere. <laughs> yeah. yep. Especially if we're working on behalf of her superior. Okay, <clears throat> so um, ah. do me uh, do me a favor, and because um, she's going to she's gonna remit her uh, counter case. Um, so basically all she's going to do is just roll a persuasion uh, check, Objection. and you guys also need to roll a persuasion check, and you will all Who get to roll Who are we persuading? Together. The guards? The guards, yeah. The people around her. Shit. Okay. And you're not yeah. going to be able to persuade everybody. I'll, I'll persuade the paper in the office. Holy shit, I rolled a nat 20. Of course you did. And if you'd like some D&D distilled down to its awesome essence, check out the illustrated Tales from My D&D Campaign.